Hello dear fans. How to calculate the height of a triangle. A straight line segment drawn from the apex of the triangle in the direction of the opposite side and perpendicular to it is called the height of the triangle. The opposite side is called the base, and since the triangle has three peaks and sides, the heights on different bases are the same. Depending on the known parameters of the triangle, different formulas can be used to calculate the height, some of which are shown below. Instructions Step 1. Use the formula ha equals 2 asterisk s slash a to find the height of a triangle if you know its area, s, and the length of the side opposite to the corner from which the height, a, is drawn. This side is called the base, and the height is referred to as base height a, ha. For example, if the area of the triangle is 40 square centimeters, and the length of the base is 10 centimeters, then the height will be calculated as follows. 2 times 40 tenths is equal to 8 centimeters. Step 2. If the length of the base is not known, but the length of the adjacent side, b, and the angle between the base and this side, gamma, are known, then the height, ha, can be expressed as half the product of the length of this side by the sine of the known angle, ha equals b asterisk sin, gamma. For example, if the length of the adjacent side is 10 centimeters and the angle is 40 degrees, then the height can be calculated as follows, 10 asterisk sin, 40 degrees, equals 10 asterisk 0, 643 is equal to 6.43 cm. Step 3. If the lengths of all three sides of the triangle, A, B, and C, and the radius of the inscribed circle, R, are known, then the height drawn from either side can be expressed as the product of the radius of the inscribed circle by the sum of the lengths of the sides of the triangle divided by the length of the base. For example, for the height drawn from side A, this formula can be written like this, ha equals r asterisk, a plus b plus c, slash a. Step 4. It follows from the previous formula that it is not necessary to know the lengths of all sides if the length of the perimeter, p, the length of the base, a, and the radius of the inscribed circle, r, are known. Then, to calculate the height at the base a, it will be enough to multiply the length of the perimeter by the radius of the inscribed circle and divide by the length of the base, ha equals r asterisk p slash a. Step 5. If, instead of the radius of the inscribed circle, the radius of the circumscribed circle, r, and the lengths of all sides of the triangle, a, b, and c, are known, then to find the height along any base, the lengths of all sides must be multiplied and the result obtained is divided by the double product of the radius of the circumscribed circle by the length of the base. For example, for the height drawn from side A, this formula can be written like this, ha equals a asterisk b asterisk c slash 2 asterisk r asterisk a. Thanks for watching.